Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk to you about Joseph Nkosi. Okay, he is the South African ambassador to Venezuela. And he, at an event to honor Nelson Mandela, he strayed away from racial reconciliation messages like he should have. And he made a bunch of hateful and anti-American comments. And he thought, he said that Venezuela was justified in attacking the United States because of the sanctions that the U.S. put on Venezuela, but the U.S. didn't impose the sanctions until Venezuela started having extremely strong ties with Iran and making Venezuela a breeding ground for terrorists and then also oppressing Venezuelan government oppressing its own people. And the money that the government had wasn't going to the people anyway. But that's a different story. All right, well, and then he offered the South Africa, the SANDF, the South African National Defense Force, he offered their help, too. Uh, now, keep in mind, though, the, in the current South African government's defense, they had, uh, once they heard this news, they summoned him and made him apologize, and he apologized. I don't think he meant it, but the South African government demanded that he retract what he said. Um, but then, I mean, he didn't stop, though. Joseph Nkosi didn't stop when he sa encouraged the South African National Defense Force and Venezuela to attack the United States. He said, the days of the U.S. dominating the world are over, which the U.S. is one of the most generous superpowers that the world's ever had, and I've uh, mentioned that in previous videos. And this just shows you how ignorant, how anti-American Joseph Nkosi is, and he shouldn't be South Africa's ambassador to Venezuela. Anyways, hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless, and bye-bye. Bye-bye.